You're watching Rapunzel. Once a carpenter and his wife prayed for a little child in their life. Someone would enter their lonely world. The wife would give birth to a baby girl. Oh. <laughs> the wife would stand at her window for hours, staring at a garden full of flowers. The flowers, the plants, the fragrance so rich. Alas, the garden belonged to a witch. She asked her husband for a treat, the magic lettuce she'd want to eat. Oh no, the terrified husband said, the witch will hurt me really bad. The wife said, I'll get weak and fall, but I won't eat anything at all. The carpenter really had no choice, he entered the garden without making noise. He stole a lettuce and fed his wife She felt so happy and alive She hadn't tasted such food before So she wanted to have some more Again he climbed the garden wall But he slipped and had a big fall The witch heard the sound and got curious She came and saw him and got furious The husband begged her for his life I just wanted some lettuce for my wife Boy, should I let you go? She said The carpenter saw his doom ahead <laughs> The carpenter begged her to let him go Whatever she wanted, he would do so The witch said Alright, let's make a deal And you can have lettuce for every meal Hmm Oh. You can't have a baby girl, it's fine And your baby from that day will be mine The carpenter got very scared and ran And then <laughs> looked at the garden again <laughs> Soon the wife had a baby girl With golden hair glowing like a pearl The carpenter made a tower so tall And on top of it he made a big hole The witch won't be able to cast her spell That's how he saved his little girl The witch saw the tower in her magic ball And she was able to know it all She magically put both of them to sleep So that their daughter was hers to be The witch climbed the tower and saw the little girl She named the baby Rapunzel Staring out her window What to do she just didn't know <sighs> The birds would sing to make her feel better She wanted to go out but the witch wouldn't let her One day a prince was passing through the woods He heard Rapunzel sing and thought she was good hmm. <laughs> He wanted to get close to the voice but the poor prince didn't have a choice He wanted to know the source of the sound He wanted to go up so he looked around He 
check the tower with a heart full of hope But neither a staircase nor was there a rope He heard a noise and hid behind a tree And from there everything he could see Oh! The witch looked at the window up there Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair He went up using Rapunzel's golden plate Smiling, the prince, he decided to wait <laughs> when the witch left, the prince went over there Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair She thought the witch had come back so soon It was a beautiful night with the full moon <laughs> She let down her hair and saw it was a switch The prince came up instead of the witch Rapunzel got angry at the prince And asked him to leave the tower at once Oh. She hadn't met anyone except the prince She was born and locked up ever since The prince told Rapunzel about himself He asked her to speak of herself The prince saw that her story was dim He asked her to come out with him Although Rapunzel didn't know what to say they became friends from that very day! <laughs> <laughs> Each day when the witch left the tower, the prince climbed up with a beautiful flower. The songs of the birds had a new melody, the joy on Rapunzel's face they could see. <laughs> A new greenery was seen on the trees There blew a cool and refreshing breeze One day the witch learned about the prince She got angry and lost sleep ever since hmm. <laughs> One day the prince went with a rose so red But a fairy from the witch and said Oh you want to steal my Rapunzel from me? Now from this day you shall never see <laughs> The prince went blind and was left in the jungle Rapunzel blamed herself for the struggle And when Rapunzel couldn't take it anymore For her sorrow she could only see one cure She wasn't scared of the witch's tricks She left the tower to look for her prince After spending many days in the jungle Her body was weak, her walk was a stumble One day she found the prince blind and weak A tear rolled down her beautiful cheek As her tears fell into his eyes A magical spell was cast into the sky By the magic the witch's tower burned Then the prince's eyesight returned The prince on his beautiful horse carried her To his great kingdom where he married her Reunited with her friends again, Rapunzel could barely her joy contain. They were so happy to have found each other. Together they lived truly happy forever. Hey there, you're watching Cinderella. Once upon a time lived a beautiful girl A kind heart shone like a pearl Without a mother her pain had grown Her father brought a new mother so she would be alone Her new family was nice to her But she didn't know their plans from afar When her father became a star They started to behave so bad with her Her stepmother and her stepsisters Made her work till she had blisters She became a servant in her own house she lived in the attic with a pet mouse Covered with 
with ash as she cleaned the house. Her skirt was torn, as was her blouse. She was now called Cinderella. She cried herself to sleep beneath the umbrella. Huh? One day an invite to a royal ball arrived The prince had decided to find his bride All the girls of the town were invited Everyone felt so delighted <laughs> Cinderella wanted to go to the ball Her stepmother and sisters locked her in the hall She cried surrounded by her animal friends She lost all hope of being saved from her end Huh? Her fairy godmother appeared with a smile She promised to dress her up in style Her magical wand made huge sparkles Cinderella felt herself move around in circles Oh Dressed in a gown as blue as the sky Her glass slippers made her stand so high A pumpkin became her royal carriage She looked ready for a grand marriage Oh Hmm Her mouse became a horse to pull apart The dog became her horseman so smart Cinderella sat Aww. down ready to depart One rule she had to remember by heart Hmm Huh? Could dance hmm. with the prince all night hmm. but She had to return home by midnight hmm. The magic spell would end by that time The clock tower would signal hmm. her with its chime <laughs> Cinderella sped over the countryside She reached the castle and stepped out with pride Everyone in the ball looked with surprise She became the apple of everyone's <laughs> eyes <laughs> The handsome prince reached out for her hand He danced with her in the palace grand Cinderella had stolen his heart He never wanted her to stay apart <laughs> Just then the clock tower chimed away Cinderella realized she huh? had to run away It was about to be midnight The magic spell huh? would break that very night Cinderella ran as fast as she could She dropped a glass slipper on the stairs made of wood She jumped into her coach and sped away Before the prince could catch her bay She reached home just in the nick of time With a poof everything turned back to grime Dressed in dirty rags and bare feet She dreamed of the prince who was so sweet <laughs> the prince decided to look for her He would even ask each and every star He went to every house in his kingdom With the glass slipper in hand looking so glum <laughs> Huh? He didn't know her name or where she was seen Whoever fit the glass slipper would be his queen Finally he came to Cinderella's house He wondered if he would ever find his spouse <laughs> The stepsisters fought over the shoe Declaring themselves as the prince's love true But neither could fit into the glass slipper They broke the slipper, being huh? so bitter Huh? huh? Oh. oh! The prince cried out in sheer uh. alarm How would he now find his lady charm? Huh? Cinderella slowly walked up to him Bringing out her second glass shoe for him <laughs> The prince shouted out with great, great joy His princess he had found a hoy Cinderella stepped into the shiny glass shoe She fit in as she was meant to do huh? 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 The stepmother
mother and stepsisters left town. Cinderella became a lady of the crown. She and the prince lived very happily. Their story was heard by every family. Yoo-hoo! Please click to subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get updates on our new videos.